Uh, saw a Riddler trophy over here. Let's. Oh, this DNA shows I came through here. So, Let's see through this door. Oh, there it is! Game of Cat and Mouse. And often to learn to survive on Gotham streets. Selena Kyle took the theory to survive with determined to do in style. She learned martial arts and trained extensively to perfect her skills at, at cat burglary. Her criminal activities are often hammered by re 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 reluctant altruism, making her an inconsistent villain and occasional hero. She regularly eludes captured by the Dark Knight and retains a complicated, adversarial relationship with Batman that frequently turns flirtatious and occasionally legitimate romantic. Ugh. Real name, Selena Kyle. Occupation, professional thief. Mace operations, Gotham City. Eyes, green. Hair, black. Height, 5 feet, 7 inches. Weight, 125 pounds. First appearance, Batman number 1, Spring 1940. Attributes, trained gymnast and athlete. Expert hand-to-hand -hand combat. Highly skilled with her specialized whip. A cat o nine tails, capable of astonishing of astonishing stealth, obsessed with and adept at stealing famous, more protected items, drawn to cat motif. So she's legit a cat burglar. So now we know more about Catwoman. Okay, that kind of scared me a little bit. Yeah, I think it's really cool how they put the little batterings like on the floor where Bruce goes on and kind of shows him, shows it being on the floor. That's kind of cool. Ready? Oh man, so this one we might have to do stealthy. And Joker is a complete goddamn psychopath. The more we know about Joker, ladies and gentlemen, the more we know about Joker.
He's right behind you! <laughs> that was so nerve-wracking! Oh my gosh! Looks like they go through these doors. Mama's bank, really? Sharpie is a bad word. Mama spake. What the? I don't want to know. What kind of magic tricks? So where does the path continue? Does it continue through here? Okay. Oh. Yeah, I don't think Shark went through there. It continues this way. I'm such an idiot. I'm such an idiot. Oh, no. Oh, no, it hits down here. Uh, again, idiot. Oh, 
Get the guy with the gun. Don't you pick up that gun. You all been very bad. Pop up that's gonna have to spank you all. Hey, what's ugly? Oh. It continues to here. guys if I'm being quiet I really like to need to focus on the battle segments of these things okay that one bites the dust Hugged himself for a little while. Hey, go through this door. Ooh, what's this? So guys, basically every single one of those tally marks is uh, basically a person that he murdered. you come from? You weren't there before. Because I am an old man. Now how old Bruce Wayne is? I believe in the DCU films, he's like 45. It's like we're doing this the old fashioned way. I don't like how there's cheering. I really don't like how there's cheering. So, guys, I should probably let you know that Gotham, that Gotham does not just 
have criminals. But also psychopaths, the crazies. Destroy more Joker teeth. And this takes criminally insane to a whole new level. And look who it is. Tennis Pamela Isley was transformed by a science experiment gone wrong into a plant-human hybrid. With chlorophyll flowing through her veins instead of blood, she developed a toxic touch and ph pheromone fluid talent for a seduction. Her crimes have become more ecologically focused as she increasingly abandoned her human side, identifying more with the nature natural world. Her unique brand of eco-terrorism often puts her into conflict with Batman, whose iron will usually protects him from her seductive powers. Real name, Pamela Lillian Isley. Refre occupation, professional criminal. Base operations, Gotham City. Eyes, green, hair, red. Height, 5 feet, 8 inches. Weight, 115 pounds. First appearance, Batman, number 181. June, 1966. Attributes, ability to encourage and direct the growth of all plant life. Plant, G plant, Genes mix in with her DNA and make her an unpredictable and formidable physical opponent. I hope my camera didn't pick up on that because that's copyright. Excludes, excludes natural pheromones that enable her to exert control over her victims. Skin secrets a toxin. No, skin secretes a toxin that... That can make her touch deadly. Pathological drive uh, and pathological drive to rid the world of humanity and make it safe for plant life. This is where I'll have to end it off here for now.